Oh, Bertha. Wow. You hear, you haven't birth? They've scratched upholstery and the paintwork. Everything and looks William, scratched and beat. Them. He's so Including you. How y'all doing? It's your boy JC and welcome back to another The Cat Lady. Check my hand. Support black business as usual. I appreciate you. Welcome back to part six. No. Part seven. Part seven, my bad. So this is the last, I would say the last few parts of the series. Can we get five likes for the rest of the series? I, don't, I mean, I don't know what to tell you. Like, <laughs> Ambu's eating. <laughs> we still trying to figure out other things about Susan and some symbolisms that we've been seeing in the game so far. Unfortunately, you know, as much as we we mess with Mitzi, you know, she don't got a lot of time left. And that in itself, we got to figure out Mitzi's true intent when she meets the dude that uh, pretty much killed her boyfriend. So without a further ado, let's get into this bit. And this is it. So this is when we're going to find our the dude. What are you writing for? Loser. Okay, so let's hmm. How do we do this? Well, let's go all the way to the first and work our way up. We gonna work our way up to Black Force Air Energy, you feel me? So that's our cats, they eating. Okay, so that's flat two. What about one? What does the note say? Read from flat one. We apologize for cluttering the hall. The removal of company having has been called and they will collect the sofa and chairs soon. Yeah, that's said like three years ago. You were sorry for the inconvenience. We are just, but we're sure you could put up with the few items for a bit longer. It's like we put up with your dog for all these years. Yep, bitter. Knock. What's up? Nobody answering. No one's home. Hey, bruh. Open. Mitzi, can't you pick lock? You pick lock that bit. Let's find a lock first. It's right there, man. So, what next? Let's look around first. We must check everyone. I'm absolutely sure Eye of Adam is living in one of these flats. We know that. I need you to pick the lock. Now it works. Why Would you like to try your famous lock picking skills on this lock here? Let's see. Okay. A young child could open this lock with a piece of wire. Then do That's it. That's fantastic. Have you done it yet? Exactly. No. I can't work when you're looking over my shoulder. I need to see the tech. Do you mind? Oh my no? god. No, sure. I'll just walk away for a minute and stare at the wall if that's what it takes to get this done. Thanks. Really, Mitzi? You said it's easy, but yet you don't want me to see... She capping, bro. She really capping. You know, she got the skeleton key. All right, let's get in here. Oh, heck, nah. What is this? Spanner? Well, I don't think he in here, right? There's a hole. Look, mommy, there's a hole. What? There's no way I can uh, reach it. It's too high. That table is on the right. Wasn't damaged so badly. I could probably stand on it, but it's all rotten. I probably only fall and break my neck. I'll have to find another way to get that statue from up there. Shut up. Window. This is the sunny side of the building. My side is always covered in dark, or so it seems. Maybe you're just dark. Perhaps dark. Clearly, than me. this place is empty. I reckon we can cross it off the list. Okay. Okay. This is A. What does depression feel like? You know what it feels like? Stop asking me dumb questions. Well, it feels like all I want is to die, but I have to live. That's funny. Most of the time I feel like I want to live, but I have to die. Dang. She's not really depressed. It'd be like that, bruh. All right. I was depression. Why'd you ask that question like that? All right, man. All right, radiator. Radiators are some of the few remnants of the old days. Most have been taken off the walls. Those that are left haven't been working for years. Jesus. You know, you ever heard of Jesus? I'll start screaming. Let me listen. <laughs> Oh, heck no. Nah. That's a dog. We don't mess with them boys. He a dog. You want to pick lock this? But well, I don't know if we can deal with the dogs, so. Bad idea there's a dog inside. I hate dogs. Facts. <laughs> if it's not in the, the game name, then what is it? All right, let's see. Check map. We can't go to the dog yet. Maybe we need something to distract the dog because we got to see what's going on or something. There's an old man. There's Brian O'Connor. Mm, there's noise in the flat eight. 
maybe we can just go to the old man because i'm assuming we probably i don't know let's just oh don't that don't do don't, 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 don't that don't do don't, don't. that's probably brian o'connor what is this a rag borrow all right let's listen i heard someone cough he's home all right okay knock would you like to talk to him sure I'll pretend I'm doing one of those customer surveys. Old people usually have time to answer lots of stupid questions. I wonder if he can hear us. Nah. They just want some attention, Mitzi. Man. They probably have bad hearing. Never mind. I, I capped on that last statement. Hello there, sir. Ooh. If you could spare skin. us just a few minutes of your time, we'd like to ask some questions about your internet service provider. You ain't got no I'm not interested. I don't have any money. Go bother someone else. Oh. Don't but we're end. not trying to sell anything. It's just a little survey. What? Wait a second. I, I can't hear what you're saying. Now sweetie. you can't hear. Let me get my hearing aid. Do you think he'll be back with a shotgun? Yeah, probably. Don't be silly. This isn't America. Where are we at then? Where are we live? <sighs> I thought I heard someone. We live in what Italy, did you right? Want? Uh, I don't know. Do you live? Do you alone? live alone? When you're an old man like me, you end up watching all your friends and family die. I'll be eighty-five this year, but I can still cook my dinner and I make my bed every morning all by myself. Okay. So, you do live alone then? Look, young lady. I don't need any help. I've told them already. I can manage just fine. I can still cook my dinner, and I make my bed every morning all by myself. And not that it's any of your business, but when I die, I'll die in my own home, in my own bed. I, I'm honestly not trying to take that away from you. We're just here to ask about... I will not have anyone washing me, or, or dressing me, or feeding me. No, you don't want to be in the nursery home. I can manage. I've done it all my life, and it'll stay this way. Dang, bro, you don't I want some... I can still cook my bed, and, and I make my dinner every morning, all Nurse by myself. <laughs> um, I didn't even mean to pry. Please accept my apology. I didn't mean to pry. Please accept my apology. No, no, no. It's, it's me who should be sorry. No. I haven't even offered you ladies a cup of tea. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Mary always liked her tea milky. Oh my god, she'd not put Mary. put the tea bag in the milk in first, and, and then finally she'd add hot water. Yeah. I kept telling her it's the wrong way, but she never listened. Yeah, she wanted she her throat gone. She was always so gone. stubborn, my Mary. I miss her every day. I'm sorry for your loss. Is this it? Okay. Do you own computer connected to the internet? Say again? Right. Okay. Do you- I can't hear you very well, dear. You'll have to speak up. I'm an old man, you know. I'm right in front I'll of your be face. 85 this year. Uh-oh. Do you have a computer? There's no need to shout. I've got my hearing aids. I can hear what you're saying. Sorry. Then you can hear young, these fists about to be flying in your like face yourself, in a few minutes. I wouldn't understand about old age. We live in two different worlds, dear. And if you're here to make fun of me, why won't you just go ahead and be done with it? No, no. With all respect, I... These fists about to make fun of you. I just wanted to ask if you by any chance own a computer. Pardon? A computer! Wait a second, dear. I think I need to change the batteries in my hearing Alright, let's dead set. I must have forgotten to switch them off last night. I'll be right back. No, wait! Jesus. I don't think I've got enough patience for this, Mrs. A. Mm -hmm. To be honest, the chances that he's our guy are pretty slim. I think we should go. Yeah, this is pointless. Even if he did have a computer, he probably wouldn't even remember how to switch it on. See, this is Let's how the, say quickly and try the dude to look is going to try to trick you. He's going to be with the old man. Can I help you? Not really. We were just going. What? I don't want to buy anything. I told you before, I'm not interested. I don't have any money. 
Do bother someone else. Man, screw the formalities. I'm out. Sorry to have bothered you, sir. We'll go now. I'll see you later, ladies. I ain't seeing nobody later. Next time I'll do the talking, yeah? Yeah. He's tough. Wouldn't answer a single question. But he can't possibly be an internet whiz. Cause you didn't yep, slap him up a he's bit. He's just a lonely old man. Let's cross him off the list. Okay. Actually, you know what? We can go to the ground floor. What other ground floor got? Oh, Bertha. Wow. You you having birth? What's up? Talk to. Hello. You live on the first floor, am I right? Yes, that's correct. That's your dog? That too. And you're Susan Ashworth, I presume. I've been meaning to talk to you, actually. You pregnant? Really? Is something wrong? Well, it's those cats. Good. I understand you're trying to do a good thing, but it's become unbearable lately. This can't be sanitary for people living here. And I'm sure it's not allowed by the council either. Uh, I, I, I didn't understand what you were saying. I, I couldn't pay attention. Man. Look, they're not my cats. You're Susan Ashworth, the cat lady. We all know what you do. Everyone's sick of those cats, and I am too. Brian said he will get in touch with animal control if things don't improve. Man, those cats gonna make you have a misc. Really? Bruh. Well, I certainly don't see any improvement on first floor. Bruh. It's still completely overrun by these filthy creatures. He'll have to talk to them again. I hear they've run out of business recently. Then he'll have to find another one. This is just not good enough. Let me know in the comment section if you almost got what I was about to say. Because if you do, you are OG. <laughs> I cannot finish that. I cannot finish that. What a, okay. Are the cats bothering you? Yes, they are, actually. They usually stay outside anyway. I bet you hardly ever see them. I see them all the time, actually. Ever since the Morrisons from Flat One moved out last month, your cats seem to reside permanently on my floor. And that sofa, my god. They're always gathered round it like it's their shrine. It was Morrison's responsibility to dispose of it, but they just left it there. And a whole load of other rubbish, too. Okay, that's not my fault, really, is it? But you encourage cats to come here. You feed them. Everyone knows that. Every time I take William for a walk, he gets upset and tries to chase them away. You call your dog Willie? Who's William? William is my dog, of course. He's 12 years old, you know. When is he, he gonna... Be anyway. running yeah. after cats at his age. Did you say they sleep on the old sofa? I didn't say they sleep. Have you not listened to me? I've been I'm listening the whole time. I wonder if they ever sleep, actually. They just keep climbing up and down the wretched thing. They're noisy. They leave germs all over the place. They've scratched upholstery and the paintwork. Everything and looks William scratched and beat. Them. He's so Including you. Lovely most of the time. What if he runs off and gets lost? Good. I'm telling you, we've never had such problems before you decided to bring here these homeless devils. That's your fault. I have to go now. See you later. Useless. And congrats on the baby. Frickazoid. Oh no, not the flowers. God. Uh, uh, that's what you do to flowers, Susan? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to push it. Don't worry, Mrs. A. No what one cares. What happened to anyone? I'll clean it in a minute. But please, Shut be up. more careful in the future, yes? You need to be more careful. Your baby about to... You be more careful. Mmm. Naughty old witch. Mmm. <laughs> uh, see, we, me and Susan just up there. Okay, well, we got some mail, broken vase. Take, ooh, this is a murder weapon. If we can get rid of the dog, mm, it's over. No mail for Susan Ashworth. Surprise, surprise. Other compartments are locked. Do we gotta unlock this bit? Hey, bro. You, lazy. WNBA woman. Do you think you can unlock this mailbox? Sure, but not with that woman over there looking at us over her shoulder. Yeah, she ain't She's gonna notice. Nosy old cow. 
Yeah, that needs to give birth soon, or I'm gonna give birth with these hands. Keep talking. Hold on, how do we distract her? So we need to distract her. Hold on. Let's go back to flat one. What if we use a piece of glass on the sofa? I'm just throwing ideas out. Can we do that? What do we do? What do we get? Reach inside. What do we get? Hey, look at this. Valerian root extract. Cats love it. Okay. It has the same effect on them as catnip. They go absolutely crazy for it. Oh, really? You found it inside that sofa? Yes. I wonder how it got there. Maybe the Morrisons wanted to leave a goodbye gift for that woman and her dog? Yes. Well, they would. I always thought they were reasonable people. Is that why they're oh, on the sofa? Oh, what a shame they moved out. You worry about the wrong things. Actually, what happens if we put the rag on the radiator? Or maybe if we put the extract in here. Maybe the cats will... Come on, guys. The party moved over here. Huh? Where are they? The frick did they go? This is A. What? What up? Oh, they... Well, God, aren't they quick? That's my Ambu. Come on, Ambu. This dog is making quite a racket. Someone should complain to the owner, don't you think? Definitely. She should put that broom down for a minute and sort a dog out. Oh, yeah, let's get it then. Hey, bruh. Bruh. Bruh, bruh. Handle that. Your dog is making horrible noise. Can't you do something? It's probably because your wretched cat's upset him again. Poor William. I'd better check on him. Yeah, drop that broom. Let me give me that. Dang, she kind of tall. Oh, that got. William! Come back, my little broom. Uh oh. Uh oh. What? Are you sure the cat'll be all right? Please. These cats can easily outrun some old mutt. Yeah, some... What? That was the weirdest sequence ever. Quickly, before they come back. Look. She left the door open. Do you want to check her flat? I'll stay here and keep watch. Good idea. Yeah, go ahead. I'll be as quick as I can. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's not her. I didn't find anything. Okay. No computers, no laptops, no telephone line. Okay. I'm not really surprised, are you? No. At least we can now cross her off the list. Alright, bet. Get out. Are we just doing one by one, my boy? Let's go. Okay, let's go back ground floor real quick. We gotta pick lock on that uh, mailbox. Broom? Let's actually take the broom. Honestly, if we have, if we take the broom, maybe we need it for something. Examine, open, uh, no mail. Oh yeah. Let's see. Do you think you can unlock this mailbox? I think I can most certainly unlock this mailbox. Then do it quickly. Someone can come in any minute. All right, I'm not looking. A little uh, room for the master locksmith. Just really. Hurry. Could you step away towards the stairs and turn around? Please? You don't like the methods. You don't like the methods being exploited, even though I'm your homie. That's... that's tough. That's tough. Master criminal. If anything. Alright, bro, what up? What Done. Get? Here's all the mail. Hide it in your pockets and let's get out of here. It was mostly junk mail and leaflets. I threw those away. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, bruh. Let's check. Let's go back to flat two and see if we can check for, uh, or flat one. My bad. You know what? There is a hole. Because I was like, if we have a broom, maybe we can use it for something. So let's actually use the broom to... What is that thing up there? Is that a... Is that something? Kind of looked like a cat. We're gonna hit that cat? I'll try to catch that thing for you, alright? Alright. Oh, you got it. Okay. I knew you got the hands. It's a statue of a cat. Oh, it's a statue. How nice. So there's another wacko obsessed with cats in this house. Lovely. His head pops out like, give me that little nip. Like, whoa, sir. I'm gonna call the authorities. Okay, um, 
Oh, you can shake it? What? And break it? There's keys in it. Hold up. Give me that. There's a key in this statue. It's a strange hiding place. What happened to the Godo doormat? I see I caught this statue only so you could smash it to pieces. Thanks. I don't remember asking you to catch anything. Ooh. Susan, you're gonna have to give her a flower sometimes. All right, let's hit, uh, hit up my boy over here in our flat. All right, brother. What's up? Let's see what's in here. I think I heard something. No, it's just probably my imagination. Okay. It's not. Uh, maid service. Nah, I guess they're not in. That's great. I never liked them much. Maybe that's the key. Maybe we use a key. Hold on. Instead of using Mitzi's help, we can use our own help. Stupid. Let's see. Oh, that worked. Do okay. you want to go in first? Oh, because that makes sense. Because that cat statue was right above their flat. So they just got a random hole. Come on in. The place seems empty. Bro, somebody... Bro, Mitzi, you are so tall. Bro, somebody should keep watch. I mean, they're both tall. Watch out, Mrs. A. There's a massive hole in the floor. Yeah, that's what I'm just saying. Step around it. I'm not blind. Nigga. <laughs> Besides, I know it's there. We saw it from the floor below. Let's have a look around. There's got to be a computer here somewhere. Beto. I really don't like this place. Yeah. It's too colorful. It's rather creepy. We need all black and white. Where are we going? Where are we at? There's a little... Uh, Bingo. Uh, we found what we were looking for. Oh, this laptop the... could be it, you know. Oh, okay. Maybe so this Joe is dude. our guy after all. He was right across us the whole time. No, no. It's a disaster. What? The power lead is missing. It won't switch on. Let's just take it and dip. Right. What There's a, a six, six, six Can we door. Go now, please? I think I've seen enough. I don't need any more trouble. No, it's okay. I've got an idea. No. No. It seems it's a similar model to mine. I'll just go back to the flat and bring my power lead. I don't know. You sure this is gonna work? Let's just take it I and do it. So. Ain't nobody At gonna care if all shot. authorities. Just stay here and I'll be back in a second. Why don't we go together? I really don't like this place. There's a 666 door. You said you door. haven't seen this guy for ages. He probably doesn't even live here anymore. Black. But if this is our guy, then Nothing's why are we... I'll be back before you know it. There's a 666 door. All right. I will count to 100. If you're not back, I'm out of here. I'll be back before you get to 75. Don't worry. Hey, I just remembered something that'll keep you busy. What? While I'm gone, think of a vegetable. What, what am I, a kid? Why? To keep your mind occupied. I bet I can guess which vegetable you were thinking of when I'm back. So you're a mind reader now? No, you're a freaking babysitter no. now. This is just a little experiment of mine. Okay, whatever. Now go. I'm counting already. No, I'm lying. Why do I always end up in places like this? You're in front of the 666 door. It's gonna be a big, hairy ball man. Oh, nah. Examine. Great, there's three sixes. The number is of the beast. He probably keeps mutilated bodies of his victim. There's, on the other hand, I read once there when I was, there was, I read once that there was some other meaning to three sixes too. Something really innocent. Can't remember now, it was a long time ago. And I've had other things on my mind. Let's see if we can open. Even if I wanted to, the doorknob is missing. Great, there's no doorknob, that's really bad. Um, sockets, coat rack. Do we answer this? It just stops ringing? What the frick? Just one big step. There's no point to stop ringing. Bro, let's get out of here, dog. I already count 100. Oh, the doorknob just Damn. fell off. The door handle just came off in my hand. Maybe How that's how we- gonna get out of here now? We gotta go to the 660 door. Okay, what are you doing? Mitzi? Oh no. Mitzi, are you there? I don't know. Shit. Yeah, yeah, bye. The heck? Careful now. Oh yeah, we gotta walk over the hole. All right, we gotta do the 666 door. Man. Oh, now it's wobbling. All right, let's see. Use, actually, we need to read the mail, by the way. Okay. 
Jesus. I don't like this. Why are we doing this? Oh, st ew, what the? What is this, a strip club? Come over here. Oh, let's take that. There's a power lead, so this is for the... the what a freak? There's a man. Oh, no. Oh, snap. Yeah, bye. Oh, what the? What the? When did she get here? I've got to get out of here. When will you twerk? Uh, hey, man. Don't mind me, bro. You feel me? I'm just... What? You talk? Oh, Jesus. No. What? You were not supposed to be here. Bro, I saw it. You working with the devil. You hosting a strip club. Why did you have to ruin everything? What did I ruin? What have you done? Oh, let's do it. stupid, evil, bitch. What you finna do about this? Who are you? you? I'm sorry, the door opened. I'm the gas inspector. There's a leak somewhere. Man, stop lying. I'm sorry, the door was open. I thought you moved out. You took her away, didn't you? Who? What has she ever done to you? Your wife? What? Look, sir, you are wrong. I just came here to find my cat. It's gone missing. Yeah, I see. That stupid cat. I've been looking for it too. The little bastard took off with my key. I'm gonna rip him to pieces. Now he gonna rip you to pieces. Oh, back up, back up. A friend knows that I'm here and she will call the police. Shut up. Man, none of these choices are good. What is this crappy retro dance music? Uh, let's see. I don't want any trouble. Let me go. I don't want any trouble. Just let me go. And I've got a gun. Just used to shoot. I can shoot you. Anything right black. There on, in your in heart. February, Black History it's Month. It's not worth it, Joe. I've done you no harm. Of course, you haven't got a heart. Isn't that right? I, oh, God. I have no idea what you're talking about. Go ahead and Listen, shoot. Listen, I've got to go now. I'll All rip right? you. I'll slowly walk out of here, and you'll never see me again. Jesus. Man, we doing the Michael Jackson. Calm down. I'll go now, and we'll forget all about this. There's nowhere to go. It's all wrong. No matter what I do. Damn it! Get back here right now and give me that blasted key! Where is this energy coming from? Please, don't get angry. I don't have any keys. Just sit down and take a deep breath while I make my way out, all right? Yeah. Oh, snap. Bro. Hey, what? Oh! Uh, are we dead from that? Oh, uh, not four doors. We have to be dead from that. Oh, uh, Jesus, Missy. Why did she take so long, dude? It's because it's, we're literally across from the dude. Like, says, came through here, devil. This is a puzzle? Devil came through here? Is that what we need to do? Come on, stop it. Stop it. I play pocket mirror for a living. Get me in here. Oh, never mind. Open the door. All right, what's up? Yeah, this place is demonic. Let me get in here. Oh, come in, great. Come in. Great. There's no need to be afraid. I, I don't buy. You're capping. Come in already. I might need your help with something. What is it? Your name is Joe Davis? Joe Mama. All right, no. I really can't remember the name of this town, but I'm pretty sure the hotel is called Quiet Haven. This is a hotel? I know. It's a joke. They shouldn't charge half the price for this dump, if you ask me. There's a hole in the wall, of course. This is all a dream, right? I thought you wanted to kill me. You need my help. I thought you wanted to kill me. Why would I want to kill you? 
You must be mistaken. Who do you think I am? Man who paints walls with blood, a self-obsessed, schizophrenic wife killer. Ooh. A self-obsessed, schizophrenic wife killer? What? You thought I... No. 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 I, I never hurt my wife. All this yeah. time I've been trying to save her. Well, fine. Let's say I believe you. Why wouldn't you? Look around you. This is not normal, okay? Yeah. If you don't mind, I'll only trust myself for now. As a matter of fact, I'm not sure if I can trust even myself. This is all a dream. This is all just a dream, right? It's funny that you would say that. I've already heard that somewhere today. But if this is a dream, I've been asleep for a very long time. Okay. I'm sorry. I just want to leave. Yes, I understand. I wouldn't stay here myself if it was my decision to make. I'm stuck here too. You see, my wife Ivy is in the room to the left. Okay. She's a little fragile at the moment. She Alina. said she was going to do her Time life, paradox? But it's been a week now. Maybe longer. Every time I try to talk to her, she just gets angry. And she tells me she's not done yet. I've cooked her a meal, but she ignores me. She never likes what I cook. Yikes. But what's that got to do with me? Yeah. If you talk to her, I'll show you the way out. I promise. Just go in there and tell her. Tell her she looks fine. She's right. always so careful about looking perfect. Okay, right. okay. I'll see what I can do. So, your wife's been in that room for a week. Now that you bring this up, I think it might have been a month. That's a very long time to stay in one place. She wants to look great. I guess it takes time, but we really have to go now. Females. I think there's a big storm coming. Women. I feel it in my bones. My bad, y'all. I don't call y'all females. That's messed up. Goodbye, Joe. All right. Uh, I see one, two, three, four, five. But she better be fine in a motherfucker. She's not. You have some problems, bruh. It's not letting me go over there. Or I came from here. Wardrobe. Ah, that's. Hello. I don't know what you said. Misery. That's what you it, got is from that, that. What you said. <laughs> okay. This is probably a reflection of her. She doesn't like how she looks, or maybe Joe don't really like how she looks. All right, y'all. I guess we'll figure this out <laughs> next episode. Yeah, nah. This is it. Um, this is. I think next episode we're gonna finish the series. That means this is gonna be completely done by next episode, y'all. With that being said, I I'm trying to piece this together. You know, like the dude clearly seems like he's traumatized. His family left him, or mother, or fan. Whoever the freak, they left him, or no, not his family, but maybe she doesn't like how she looks, and then, or maybe he's the one who doesn't like how she looks, so she's always trying to get ready, or, and so when she looks at herself, she thinks of misery, I don't know, um, we'll figure it out, it can be kind of, this game will be realistic for a point, a time period, and then out of nowhere, where the frick are we at, a hotel, so there's a lot of symbolism, we will piece it together, I promise you, y'all ready for the next episode, five likes. And let me know your thoughts and theories if you agree with I think. Without further ado, y'all stay blessed, keep your stay strong, and I'm gonna see you when I see you. Peace.